Looks like someone's enjoying a car wash. Well, well, well. It's Tom himself. Wash day, huh? It's Baby Tom's turn next. Where is Baby Tom? Hmm. Let's hope he's not up to any mischief. Hey there, Baby Tom. What are you up to? You're having a go with your dad's control panel? Maybe you shouldn't be messing with that, Tom. No! Baby Tom, stop! Your dad's in that room. Oh no! Poor old Tom has taken quite a beating. We know you didn't do it on purpose, Baby Tom, but you shouldn't have been sneaking around in the control room. I'm sure your dad will forgive you, but you'll have to take him to the hospital so Amber the ambulance can make him feel better. Hey there, Amber. You must be wondering why on earth Baby Tom is towing his dad. Mm -hmm. Well, there was an accident at the car wash. And Tom got beaten up by one of the machines. Can you fix him? Thanks, Amber. Baby Tom, follow Amber inside the hospital. Baby Amber, can you play with Baby Tom while your mom fixes his dad? Mm -hmm. That's really helpful. Mm -hmm. What have you got there on that tray, Amber? Some eye drops, a bucket of ice, and what's the other device, Amber? Mm -hmm. oh, oh. It's for checking Tom's eyes. Mm. Oh, you want to give Tom some ice for his head first. Oh. Mm -hmm. oh, oh, oh. Does that feel good, Tom? Uh -huh, uh -huh. Ready to check Tom's eyes now mm -hmm. that he's a bit more comfortable? Mm -hmm. Wait a minute. Where's the eye checker gone? <laughs> oh, baby Amber has it. She's copying her mom. How sweet. You'd better give that back now. Your mom needs it. That one looks okay. Oh dear, it looks like Tom got some soap in his eye. Tom, Amber's going to put some drops in your eye. It might sting at first, but it'll feel better afterwards.
Ready, steady, here it comes. Well done, Tom. You are really brave, and your eye is better now. The fun's over now, kids. It's time for Tom and his dad to go home. Thanks for taking care of Tom, Amber. And thank you for your um, help, too, Baby Amber. Don't forget to stop and take some candy on your way out. You'd better hurry home after your candy. It's getting dark. That's right. It's time for a bath and a bedtime story. Luckily for you, baby Tom, your dad knows how to operate the car wash properly. Night, night. Car Patrol. What a windy day it is in Car City. No wonder someone's flying their kite. Oh, it's baby Katie and baby Carrie. Is that a new toy, Katie? What fun! Uh-oh, the wind is getting really strong. It's even blown the girls' bows away. You're right, Carrie. It's not safe to fly the kite now. Katie, you should probably let go before you fly away. Katie, let go. It doesn't matter if it's new. Don't worry, Carrie. We'll find your friend, but we'll need some help from the car patrol. Hey, car patrol. Carrie's friend, baby Katie, was flying her kite, and she's blown away in the wind. That's a great idea, Matt. Carrie, climb onto Frank's ladder, and the three of you can go and look for Katie in all the high places around Car City. No sign of Katie yet. Have you spotted her, Carrie? Uh -huh. Oh, yes. There she is on top of that lamppost. She's still holding on to her kite. <laughs> Don't worry, Katie. The car patrol is here to rescue you. It's still pretty windy. Carrie had better come down from that ladder. Now it's your turn, Katie. Climb on. But let go of your kite first. Too late. Time for plan B, car patrol. Whoa, she is so far up, and she's still holding on to her kite. You're right. We need Hector's help. He's the only one who can reach Katie now. Hey there, Hector. Matt and Frank need you. Baby Katie is stuck on top of Car City's tallest building, and they can't reach her. There she is. Can you rescue her, Hector?
Hector has come to help, Katie, but you'll have to let go of your kite. Hector understands, but it's not safe to keep holding on to your kite. Don't be too sad, Katie. Hector's going to give you your own flying experience. Have fun, you guys! Hey! What a show! Are you ready to bring Katie back down to the ground now? Here she is, our own little kite, Katie. Great teamwork, Car Patrol. Wait, what is that? Why, it's Katie's kite. Take care now, won't you? See you next time, Car Patrol. Carl, transform. Hi, Frank. Where are you off to? Hmm? You look worried. Were you called to put out a fire? Hmm. Better hurry hmm. then. Hmm. Be careful, Frank. You want to get there quickly, hmm. but you don't want to have an accident. Look, there's Matt. He's trying to wave you down, Frank. He must know about the fire. Oh, you saw the fire, Matt? And you want to show Frank a shortcut to get to it? Good idea. Better turn around so Frank can follow you. Let's go. A fire can spread quickly. Oh my, that's quite a fire there. Thank goodness this building is abandoned and no one is inside. Do you think you can handle this, Frank? Those flames are really high. Should we go find Carl so that he can call Super Truck to help? Okay, let's go. Carl! Huh? Carl! Huh? Sorry to disturb you, but this is an emergency. Frank is at the scene of a huge fire and could use a hand. Can you ask Super Truck to help us, Carl? Great! Let's get going! Which vehicle do you think you'll transform into, Carl? Of course, a fire truck. Awesome, Carl. You're red like a real fire engine. Wow, 
<laughs> you look so different, Carl. Let's get going. Matt. Hey, Matt. Here is Super Truck. Oh, poor Matt. You didn't see Super Truck arrive, did you? This way, Super Truck. Put your sirens on. Good news, Frank. Super Truck is here to help. Good work, Frank. Great job, Super Truck. Working together, you were able to put the fire out. Now you can rest easy, Frank and Matt, knowing that there's no more danger. And Carl, I, I mean Super Truck, you can go back home and listen to your music. Thanks, guys. See you next time. <laughs>